I'm excited to talk to you today about a new variety of sweet clover that was developed by Texas A&M AgriLife Research. This particular new variety was developed for use in the central part of Texas and Oklahoma and all the way down into South Texas. Sweet clover is really well adapted to the high pH soils that we find in this area all the way from Dallas to Beeville and again into South Texas. Silver River was developed uh, with one idea in mind, it has rust resistance. Uh, rust is a disease that can cause a severe problem on sweet clover, particularly in South Texas. Sweet clover is a wonderful plant for this part of, of Texas and into Oklahoma and into the Midwest. Several uses for sweet clover can be used as a, a plant to graze, it can be used for with, with cattle, it can also be used by wildlife, and it's a wonderful bee plant. It's a wonderful plant for pollinators. We, uh, sweet clover needs bees uh, to, to pollinate and to set seed, so it is a requirement that we, we put bees on our seed fields of sweet clover, and uh, you can see some of that in some other video. But, <clears throat> Bees are, are really attracted to sweet clover and they do a great job of pollinating the, the sweet clover. Um, again, it, it really requires bees to, to pollinate and to produce seed. So, you know, really sweet clover is a multi-use plant for us. It becomes a, a, a plant for the pollinators, it becomes a plant that will produce honey with these pollinators. It's also a wonderful plant in cover crop situations where we're, we, want to, we want to plant something in the fall and we want it to fix a lot of nitrogen because sweet clover is a legume. It takes nitrogen from the air <clears throat> and puts it into the, uh, into the soil if you incorporate it. And this, this nitrogen then is available for the next crop that you'll grow. Sweet clover is an annual plant. The, the way we're using it is as an annual. Uh, it actually exists as an annual and a biennial. This is an annual form of sweet clover and this is the best type that's a, that is adapted to Texas. We're really excited about this new variety. <clears throat> it was developed through uh, cooperative research at, at Overton, at Beeville, at Uvalde, and through help with some of our extension colleagues in the, the plant pathology uh, department in College Station. So we've had a lot of help in developing this variety. Uh, it is, it is uh, a, a really good new variety of sweet clover, one of the first uh, new varieties of sweet clover, annual sweet clover, to be released in a long time. And we think it'll have a big impact across Texas, uh, into Oklahoma, and certainly into South Texas.